Hi students, now we will discuss the next topic of this chapter that is elimination method. Solving pair of linear equations by using elimination method. This is a very easy and interesting topic. So for that we will take general form of linear equations that is a1x plus b1y equal to c1 a2x plus b2y equal to c2. Here we have pair of linear equations with variables x and y. So to apply elimination method what we will do is first we will multiply equation 1 and 2 with any number such a way that both the coefficients of x in equation 1 and equation 2 will be equal or the coefficients of y either coefficients of both the equations of x or coefficients of y will be equal then we will go for we will subtract uh, both the equations so that we will be able to find the uh, value of the variable existing variable then that value we will substitute in any one of the equation to get the value of the other variable okay that is how we will uh, solve equations using elimination method now i'll take an example to explain this so taking uh, two equations 2x plus 4y equal to 4 3x plus 5y equal to 2 here we have pair of linear equations in two variables x and y this is equation 1 equation 2 to solve this first step is to equate the coefficients of both the coefficients of x either we will equate both the coefficients of x or y okay so here we will equate both the coefficients of x for that the coefficient of x here it is 2 here it is 3 isn't it so both should be same okay then only we can eliminate the coefficients of uh, the x value we can eliminate okay so for that what we will do is equation 1 we will multiply equation 1 complete equation 1 we will multiply using 3 okay to uh, in order to equate the coefficients of both the values of this equation 1 and 2 what we will do first we will multiply equation 1 with the 3 similarly equation 2 we will multiply with the equation 2 complete equation 2 we will multiply with the, the value of the coefficient over here that is 2 okay now first equation 1 multiplying with 3 we will get 2 into 3 that is 6x plus 3 into 4 that is 2ly equal to 3 into 4 that is again 2l. Now equation 2 multiplying with the 2. Okay. So it will become again 6x plus 2 into 5 that is 10y equal to 4. Hope it is clear. Now we got new equations we will take it as equation 3 and equation 4 next step is to subtract these two equations equation 3 minus equation 4 so before subtracting we will change the coefficients we will change the sign okay we will just change the sign of the equation uh, second equation over here okay if it is positive we will put negative sign if it is negative number means we will put positive sign Okay, now here after multiplying with this, we can understand the uh, both the coefficients of x is same, 6x, they are also 6x. So definitely when we subtract 6x minus 6x, we will get 0. So the x term is eliminated. Okay, 6x minus 6x is 0. So by that, the x term from this equation is eliminated. Now 12y minus 10y, that is what? Positive. 2y isn't it 12y minus 10y that is positive 2y equal to 12 minus 4 that is 8 2y equal to 8 therefore y equal to 8 by 2 that is 4 now we got the value of y that is 4 now in order to get the value of x this value of y we will substitute in any one of these equations so we will substitute in equation 1 put y equal to 4 in equation 1 so it will become 
टू एक्स प्लस फोर वाई ओके द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई इज फोर सो फोर वाई विल बिकम फोर इंटू फोर इज इन इट दैट इज वॉट फोर ओके सो दैट इज इक्वल टू टू एक्स प्लस सिक्सटीन इक्वल टू फोर टू एक्स इक्वल टू फोर माइनस सिक्सटीन इज इन इट फोर माइनस सिक्सटीन दैट इज माइनस टू वाई दैट फॉर फाइनली एक्स इक्वल टू माइनस ट्वेल्व बाय टू दैट इज माइनस सिक्स ओके सो फाइनली वी फाउंड दैट फॉर एक्स इक्वल टू माइनस सिक्स एंड वाई इक्वल टू एट सॉरी वाई इक्वल टू फोर आर द रिक्वायर्ड आंसर्स हॉप इट इज क्लियर